The crowning act of the 1947 Marian Congress was the consecration of the Dominion of Canada to Mary, the Mother of God. Crowning act, these are the words Venerable Pope Pius XII used to describe this Canadian Marian milestone. It recalls the words of Jesus to Lucia through Our Lady of Fatima. Jesus wishes to make use of you to make me known and loved. He wants to establish in the world devotion to my Immaculate Heart. To whoever embraces this devotion, I promise salvation. The Marian Congress, held in the nation's capital just two years after the Second World War, the war Our Lady of Fatima warned of should we not stop offending God, had but one choice for her queen, Our Lady of the Cape, crowned as the Queen of Canada in 1904 by Pope Pius X. Our Lady of the Cape, fashioned after Our Lady's image of the miraculous medal, who is the Immaculate Conception, inspiring the prayer, O Mary, conceived without sin, pray for us who have recourse to thee. Our Lady of the Cape, declared the Queen of the Most Holy Rosary by Father de Salette following the 1879 miracle of the Rosary Ice Bridge over the St. Lawrence. Our Lady of the Cape, whose miracle of the eyes in 1888 was witnessed by Blessed Frederick Yansun, the Franciscan priest who re-established the practice of praying the way of the cross in the streets of Jerusalem and the first pilgrim director of the Shrine in Three Rivers, Quebec and who was beatified by St. John Paul the Great. It is under her patronage that all Canadians are invited to celebrate the 70th anniversary of the historic Marian Congress taking place in June of 2017 to recall the Congress that was the occasion for an exceptional reunion of ecclesiastical dignitaries belonging to all parts of the world, inspiring such testimonies as that of the Bishop of Lyon, who later wrote, it will not be possible from now on to evoke celebrations in honor of the Blessed Virgin in any part of Christendom without recalling the name of Ottawa. Such was the impact on the world of this gathering. All Canadians are invited to entrust themselves to the Immaculate Heart of Mary as requested by Jesus through Our Lady of Fatima and to participate in a novena for the healing of Canada leading up to the 150th anniversary of the birth of our nation. Visit catholicincanada.com to view the 1947 20-minute documentary and celebration option details. Our Lady of the Cape, Queen of Canada, pray for us.